Hi and welcome to Easy Tutoring. Today we are going to cover how you can find the square root of a trinomial. So before I even jump into this video, I want to go over a very simple concept. x squared. If we take the square root of x squared, it is simply equal to x. So a square root and a square will always, always cancel each other out. So this is something very important to know before we do this. Here's why. Well, we, uh, we are going to take this trinomial, we are going to write it as something squared. When we write it as something squared, then we can simply cancel the square root of the square and we're left with um, a simple binomial. So we are going to go ahead and factor this trinomial. We want two numbers that multiply to 16 and add to 8. Those numbers are obviously 4 and 4. 4 times 4 is 16. 4 plus 4 is 8. So when we factor this, it's just equal to x plus 4 times x plus 4. And we can rewrite two binomials like that as x plus 4 squared, right? So now check it out. Square root, square. Square root, square. We know that a square root and a square will always cancel each other out and we will be left with whatever was squared, whatever's inside the parentheses, x plus four. That is your answer. That's how you do it. So pretty simple. We're gonna uh, do the same thing for the other problem. We want two numbers that multiply to four and add to four, obviously, two plus two x plus 2, x plus 2, square root. We can go ahead and rewrite this as x plus 2 squared. And a square root and a square cancel each other out, so we're left with x plus 2. So that is how you can take the square root of trinomials. Hope you guys understand this better. If you guys ever want ACT or SAT help, be sure to visit my website, www.e-ztutoring.com. Thank you guys, and have a good day.